Good morning, everyone. Dr. Vicki here speaking to you from the Seeds of Transformation Healing Center. Today is the 29th of August. It is a Thursday, and the moon is in Cancer. Uh, we're looking at a Jatura. These plants um, only they open up at night. Um, they start. Uh, they have a beautiful fragrance. You can't really smell it right now because um, as the day starts, the, the, the smell goes down. You start to smell it in the later evening and then at night, it's just wonderful. It's a night bloomer. And um, I thought you, some of you might be wondering what it is. The bee yeah, obviously likes it. Uh, <laughs> hi there, little bee. All right, the sweetness of life. Oh, we also have some Back here, some of the, um, see that red flower back there? That's the cannas. They're starting to bloom. Um, they got in kind of late this year, but uh, these are all cannas as well. Um, they're just not ready, quite ready to bloom yet. And then, of course, the morning glories up here, blooming lovely. There are moonflowers on this. The moonflowers take longer. The big leaves here are moonflower leaves. And uh, they are glorious. Also night uh, bloomers. We actually had one bloom, but we missed it because it blooms at night. <laughs> and when we found it, it was already starting to, to pass. And there's that little rose back there. That rose was bought uh, years ago from uh, Michael's mother's. Uh, it's like her memorial rose. It's a climbing yellow rose. And... Uh, we hadn't seen it for a while, and it decided to come up and bloom this year, so that was lovely. All right, so enough, enough of that. Um, oh dear, what's going on with that rose? Oh, strange. Okay, um, what's going on astrologically? Well, at 9.23 this morning, Eastern Time, Venus um, is going to be moving into uh, Libra, Venus and Libra. The sign of balance. Um, when the sun's in Libra, we're in, in the fall, and you know that happens next uh, next month um, in September, and uh, that's sort of the the balance time. But um, Libra is one of the signs that Venus rules, and so it's very powerful in Libra. Um, and then about an hour later uh, or less, it makes a trine to. Pluto. This is part of the configuration in the sky right now with Venus trining Uranus, trining Pluto, and opposing Neptune. Venus taken into the stratosphere, as it were, or into the <clears throat> galactic energies. This, it's all. It's almost as if uh, she's beaming love to the whole, to the whole galaxy. <laughs> anyway, sorry. <laughs> You feeling it? You feeling it? Oh my God! It feels so good, doesn't it? It just feels so good. Um, the idea of um, women um, and 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 the divine feminine rising, and men rising up as well. Um, it's just a beautiful thing. So, hey, Charlie, what are you doing up there? You know you're not supposed to sit, sit on the table. He goes to outside tables don't count, Mama. <laughs> so this is a great uh, is a great day to make friends. It's a great day to connect with friends, uh, people you love, and people you you don't realize you love yet. This is a love fest, guys. Enjoy it, enjoy it, enjoy it. Um, this Saturday on my channel. Ona and I will be doing Mystic Sisters, so you can join us for that. Um, every Mystic Sister, we have like a theme, and this might be um, love. <laughs> I'm thinking love. Buck buckets of love might be the theme. Let's see. There's some. I want to just see if we have any flowers over here yet. Yeah, these big, um, these are also moon flowers, but I'm not sure I see any blooms yet they're pretty though 
different color green texture if you're wondering what these uh, yellow flowers are these well th some would call them weeds <laughs> but those are um, um, primrose that's what wild primrose looks like the yellow flowers they're all over the yard and at night sometimes if you look they glow because they're so yellow especially when the moon shines on them all right um, what else do I want to say? Uh, you can check out um, the astrology for the rest of the week. I know it's almost done, but it's out there. Um, and if you want to join us for the introduction to the Kabbalah, there are still uh, spaces available. It is, it is. Uh, we are getting students, so if this is your opportunity uh, this this time, uh, I do them about every six months. Um, my Kabbalah classes. So, if you are interested, you can join. If you're, if you're, if you're not quite ready to climb the tree of life, <laughs> so we're, um, we're, uh, we we could also do it. Uh, we're also, I'm also, I'll also do it in the spring. So, you won't, you won't miss out. But it it may be a little more expensive next spring. I will say that. I'll, I don't. I I try to keep the prices reasonable, or how I see is reasonable. The information is great. The people are great, um, but I, I think I am going to just raise raise it up a little bit. So um, get in for the uh, the twenty twenty four uh, price, I guess you could say. What else do I want to say? Tarascos will be coming out later today. If you're interested in that, uh, for September, and um, enjoy this beautiful energy, Venus transformation, love flow, power, power of the feminine. Take care, everyone. Good morning. Namaste.